What is good? What is good? How's everyone doing on YouTube? Anyways, today, guys, I'm rocking the Adidas EQT ADV today in the black, white, and turbo colorway. There's a couple of these that are released in different colorways. I think this is the best one, so I picked them up. And plus, they only retail for 110 bucks, so that doesn't really necessarily hurt your wallet that much compared to Boost or even uh, the more expensive NMD lines. Anyways, guys, this is a pretty great shoe. I recommend getting them. Uh, they look good in anything. Uh, for one thing, they have a pretty aggressive traction, although I wouldn't highly recommend using these for like running or cross training or CrossFit, maybe something to wear to like the gym. Uh, just because I see these as more of a lifestyle shoe. Now, they do have an aggressive traction pattern as you guys, as you guys uh, can see or you saw, uh, but the the sole on, on these is very rigid and sturdy. I talked to other people about it. They say it's very solid and not so much com comfort in there even though it does use a ortho light comfort which is you know just your standard comforting uh but you're not really gonna get much out of it uh but it does have a prime knit upper which definitely makes up for the weakness of the the outsole or the sole wise being you know kind of rigid and, and more solid and lack you know flexibility so if you guys can see my toes are kind of wiggling in that prime knit which is you know it's almost like a nike sock dart where the the flying of the nikes and the prime knit of these adidas are not so much dense so it does make up for the weakness of you know being uh the you know, outsole being very uh you know very structured and strong there but overall guys i think this is a great shoe to have for 110 bucks you can't go wrong with these they look good in almost anything look at me wearing joggers looks awesome uh, on feet, I think it looks great for for this style. Very uh, a classic retro in the Adidas fashion compared to you know Nike or Jordans uh, when they released their retro shoes. So I definitely like these. Um, you know, if you guys can't afford Ultra Boost or Yeezys, you know, af afford that kind of fashion. These are a great shoe to have. You know, I have abundance of Ultra Boost and NMDs, but to have these in my in my collection, they you know it provides something a lot whole lot different platform than you know those casual shoes that everybody gets anyways guys the video's running out uh hopefully you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys liked it or not and i'll check you guys later uh peace out guys in the next video latest